Greetings YouTube, this is Artman Advanced taking a quick break from Let's Play Euphoria. I just found out a couple of interesting things in RPG Maker VX and I would like to share with you right now. Say you have an event that you want, like a treasure chest or a chest of drawers or a person giving you an item, but you only want that to happen once. Well, let's see what happens when we actually make the event here. Uh, I'm going to make it an elvish person giving you a potion. I'm going to make this a conditional, though. Uh, let's see here. There we go. Conditional branch. No, not a conditional branch. Show choices. First, let's uh, get him to say something. Here's where we go to show choices. Choice one, yes. Choice two, no. Don't really need anything fancy right this second. So let's go to what they have. Now, if we say yes, ah, uh, no, we're not gonna have him say any. Well, yeah, we got to have him saying something. Otherwise, the character won't know anything about it. Ah, uh, let's see. Once we have him saying something, we're going to go to, say, change, not change weapons, change items. Uh, let's just make it a potion for right now. And if we say no, Alright, now normally this is what you think you would need, right? Well, let's see what happens when we actually put it into motion. Any time now. For some reason my computer doesn't like opening these projects all that quickly. There it goes. Alright. As you can see, we've got everybody here. We have no items. We talk to our little guy right here. Alright, we turned him down once. Now let's see what happens when we tell him, yes, we do want one. We have a potion. But... Now we have two. This is what we don't want. So how can we get this to work actually? Work correctly? What we do is we go in here, right here under change potion, change items. We add a cell switch to A. We say okay. We make a new page for this. Use the same graphic as it as the last time. We set here, self switch A is on. Now let's give him something to say to show the player that they have received their free item and they will not give, be getting any more than mooches. Now you gotta watch out this arrow right here. If I put anything right here, yes, it'll cut off. All right. Now we apply that and see what happens now. As soon as it loads up again. There we are. 
Now, we have no items. Our party's as normal. Here's our traveler. You say, yes, we would like one. And now we have one. Let's try to get another one, shall we? So now, it's set to where he won't give you any more. Period. You can use this on anything you want. Treasure chest, chest of drawers, even a rock. You can do this for anything you want to. It'll only give you one item. Your players can't cheat the game by harvesting all the items, gold, etc. they want out of it. I hope you found this tutorial useful, and thank you again, Internet. See you next time.